everybody in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you be able to test your game on Android or iOS without actually having an actual device so Unity has a a emulator I can emulate these devices I'm going to show you how you can get yours installed so in this game here this bowling game that I'm currently still working on if I click on the ball nothing happens but what uh, what should happen here is that I should pick it up and be able to throw it but because it's coded with touch gesture then my mouse click is not working so stay tuned I'm gonna show you how you can actually get an emulator right here inside of unity and it's pretty cool and just how to set it up for version um, I believe it's 2019 and uh, higher so there's a device emulator that is still in production at the time of this video well, I'm sorry not in production at the time of this video but it's still in development and you can already get it in your unity now to find it you'd have to go to windows and then package manager and once the package manager screen comes up which you see right here i'm actually going to detach it there it is this package uh manager screen um what should be here is there should be a drop down here for um preview packages but um, that is not there right now for me. So if you're having this issue, um, then I'm going to show you how you would fix this. But normally, if it was there, you would simply just type device um, emulator. And then you'll be able to just install it. And bada beam, bada beam, you're good to go. All right. So if you don't see it, like I'm not seeing it here. I just kind of wanted to cover this for everyone. So if you don't see it. What you want to do then is head over to your project settings and the project settings you find package manager right here you click on that and see what it says enable preview packages you want to say yes to that it will tell you give a little warning that it's still under development and it's not ready for production you would be like yeah I don't mind it's cool and then um, what you want to do next is simply Go back now to the package manager. So go to window, uh, package manager. And now that you're here, I'll detach it one more time just to have it right here in the center of the screen. Now that you're here, let's search device emulator and here it is at this point. And just go ahead and hit install. So while it's still installing here, I just kind of, kind of want to give a disclaimer that again, it's in development, okay? It is in development, so um, there might still be some bugs, some certain things that doesn't work fully, or maybe um, there's a current current uh, mobile device that it's not showing in the list from what you can um, emulate. All right, so once that's set, you'll see then now we have a game where I can still go and choose you know different scales and whatever for the game but now there's also emulator if I go to emulator now um, here I am with a tablet view of my game and then the touch the click my click mouse click will actually be registered as a um, a touch so I can go on here I can find maybe an iPhone um, 10, it's like this, and then I can play my game and see how it works here on this iPhone 10. So let's give it a spin, let's see how it goes. Alright, once I've chosen the Facebook thing, I can go to scene and click on the bowling alley, tap, and I'm getting to see like really just how it looks on this iPhone 10. And if I click on the ball, now you see it actually moves because it's like a, um, a gesture, a hand gesture. So um, looking pretty nice. Um, I definitely can see now a lot of places that I can improve. But other than that, it was looking pretty nice. Then a second ago when I picked it up, uh, just you know a couple of errors I can already see if I try to throw it and not let it go. But then I release it. Okay, so it should reset. A second ago, it looked like it kind of went without me actually doing a little toss. All right, so, yeah, and then I can say, okay, well, how does it look on, like, a Google um, Pixel 2? 
how's it look on a Nexus 4? You know, I can kind of like see, okay, maybe I should bring this UI down. But I said anyways, I don't want to kind of, I don't want to go too much into uh, my <laughs> issues. Just kind of how you guys can get this going for yourself without having to have the actual device. And yes, um, Androids are in here too. You got your Sony, you got um, your Apple devices, and of course your Android devices are, um, you know, your um, Google Pixels and uh, HTC, all that stuff. All right, well, that's it. I uh, hope you guys enjoy this one. You have a great day.